Let's go guys. Doing Bowman Hobby. This is a new case, of course. break this up here there's the 4b and there's a 4b all right three stacks of fours uh one two three four five six there's a dice uh it's a five one two three four five right there so break these continue with this case tomorrow night this break here in a couple minutes meanwhile I will check out the scores uh, look at this look at this wash guys this wash guy is crushing it for the angels Jared wash Man, four for four, seventh home run, 29 RBIs for this kid. Jeez, I mean, the kid, he's 27, but. Castle hit a home run. Uh, aren't they? Yeah, they're crazy. I know. I can't even touch uh, Wash right now. Steph Curry, 29 points tonight. <laughs> Yeah, I'm glad to see it, man. I just wish the Angels had some pitching, man. I want Mike Trout there. Who looks for non-chrome base cards? I probably, well, I haven't been asleep. That's nuts, man. That's crazy. For non-chrome base cards, going for 20 bucks? What? Yeah. That's Bowman, too? That's, that's insane, man. Uh, Bowman. Incredible, man. Jeez. All right, guys, we'll, we'll get this thing started here, guys. Welcome to OBOG Car Breaks. We are knocking out some Bowman tonight. Bowman Hobby. Third case break. This is our first of this. We just broken jumble so far. So let's get some hobby down. And we're off. Let's go. Good luck, everyone. For those that don't know, Bowman comes with one autograph per box. His tops, series one, yeah. We have tier one after this. We haven't broken that either. That'll be fun. I enjoyed tier one from last year. All right, guys, good luck. Let's see what we have. Uh, Triplelana. Actually, he's being caught up. I think Abel. Abel's a first, actually. Get that up there. Davidson. Sleep. Ed Howard, green. I wonder if they're going to call up Ed Howard after Cubs have the uh, fire sale here before the uh, for the All-Star break. I think Cubs are going to get rid of like 
Contreras. Definitely get rid of Chris Bryant, 100%. He's got some, uh, he has some value now, Chris Bryant. Jared Klenick. Ooh, we got here, guys. Dang, that's what we got going on. All right, we got Nick Matone, 21 out of 25. Orange Shimmer, nice hit for the Phillies. Wow, Manuel, nice hit, bro. 21 out of 25. Very nice. That's a good way to start, start it off. Um... Oh, is Kalenda coming up? Oh, that's sick, dude. What? Like this week coming up or? Ooh, I'm excited about that. Juan Franco. Dinger. What? J Dom. That's a very nice auto. Yeah. A 25. Oof. It's beautiful. Garrett Mitchell, Royce Lewis, Eddie Diaz. It's a Bowman first. Thursday. Woohoo! Can't wait, man. Can't wait for that. I can't wait for the Rays to bring up Wander Franco. He's still the guy I'm really waiting for, but Kalenic is going to be exciting to watch. I think he's going to be a really good, good ball player. That's a $600 auto? No kidding. Wow. Dang, dude. Manuel just crushed. Joy Bart. I did not realize that's a $600 card. Choi. Go uh, pipeline is the Marlins. If you want insurance on that, um, Manuel, you let me know, bro. It's awesome, Martin Paper. Just uh, message me in eBay if, if you want to uh, purchase some insurance. Five hundred dollars in insurance for that. It's up to you, man. If you want that card in a one touch too, Manuel, Manuel, let me know, man. Some people don't like it in the one touches, so ooh, nice place, Jordan. So um yeah, you just let me know how you want to roll. Bobby Witt. I don't think, so we broke like three cases of Bowman Jumbo so far. I don't think we've hit, well, we have some really nice cards, but man, 600 bucks. I'm not sure if we hit that. I'm not sure. It's a Blaze Jordan. No, it's Bobby Dalbeck. My bad. Torque. Uh, I want Soto. Oops. Josh Jones, stop. Oh, you guys to see that. Green. That's a pipeline, guys. Going out to the, those Seattle Mariners. <laughs> there he is right there. Speaking of clinic, there he is. I want to see this guy up too, but I'm not sure if we see him up this year. Dylan Dingler is going to be out of 499 for the Detroit Tigers. And also, Manuel, this is all your box, bro. This is basically your box. There's that guy right there. Uh, Vaughn. There's a John Salas purse. Luciano. Oops, sorry, guys. That was Luciano Robinson Libertor. Yeah, the cards are sick for sure. Um, let's go in the uh, uh 
that's uh, Sixto, Pawson, De La Rosa for the Nats. Carlson's in actually 300 right now for the Cardinals. Guy hit his first home run, guys. Finally. First home run of the season. Josh Jung. Maybe that's what uh, Torres needed. He just needed to get that first out of the way. He's going to start smashing the ball. That's what I want to see, man. Let's go Patrick Bailey for the Giants and Marcus. Carlson, ah, there you go, man. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> he's doing pretty good, man. He, I mean, he's definitely um, front runner right now, man. He's actually, he's doing a lot better with his uh, contact than I expected. He's three hundred right now, man. I mean, he's got a few homers. He was not my choice, though, for National Rookie Year. Uh, actually, you know, Hayes was definitely my first, but then he got injured, and I was kind of it for that. But I, you know, if I was if I was going to pick over, I still I would have picked Bomb over Carlson. So Carlson's just yeah, he's just crushing it, man. I'll go here. Yeah, I was way way wrong with that. I think, I mean, I picked Juan Soto for MVP over here in the National League, Alcantara. Uh, I mean, he, he's missed some games, but I mean, it's not it's not too late for Soto to win, I don't think. Uh, I think Acuna may be the front runner right now, although he's really slowed down as of late. <laughs> he gave Fish another month to still win. Yeah. I love Juan Soto, man. He he he's my he's not my favorite player, but I think he's such a good player. Uh Pirates Pipeline. Bits go Jared Kelly. Freddie Freeman is starting to uh, heat up too. Freddie Freeman's numbers are pretty good. His average is pretty, pretty bad right now, but you know that's going to change. It's early. He's too good. I agree. I think yeah. I, I told like Juan Soto is the future face of MLB. Speaking of whom, he's only 22. Here's a Mariners positional promise. Hancock, Emerson Hancock, that's 36 out of 150 uh, out to uh, Cam. All right, Cam. Uh, Jerome, we've got some blue in the back, I guess. Marsh, and let's go. Oh, nice Sabato. 306, 499 for the Twins. Very nice, Jeff M. Carlson. Carlson. Detmers. Vogel first. Yeah, my my preseason American League pick for MVP Gomez. 
was uh, Torres because I desperately, I desperately need him to have like a MVP season year. I mean, it's kind of a dark horse, man. I'm not wasn't really, I'm not really sold on him winning a course, but I nice saw Kerstad for the Orioles. Very cool card here. Out to Anthony G. I think, uh, I, I think Mike Trout. I'm trying to think if that was really my true MVP pick. Lacey Thompson. I think it was. I I don't really think I'm. I'm not really too impressed with the American League compared to the National League. Uh, Zach Veen. I was to say, I think maybe Buxton was like, you know, I mean, again, we're talking like a month and a half, you know, in the season, two months, whatever. So, I mean, it's, you know, can't really put any stock into it. It's just something to talk about. But I think Buxton for sure was, uh, I think he was, he had a heck of a start to the season. Now he's injured, though, which is too bad. Lux, Kerstad. I'm trying to think who would be the, for, uh, the front runner over there in the, um, American League is a Trout, I guess. Trout's had a pretty good season. I'm trying to think who else is dominating over there. I don't pay as much attention as I should to the American League. Casey Mize. That's another awesome modern paper. Our pipeline is, looks like, Braves. Bobby Witt. Is that Laura? Yeah, that's not his first. You know, like, Trout, OEP, Trout, Trout, yeah, Trout's a beast, bro. I mean, he, he turned 30 this year, so... You know, I'm I'm really hoping he doesn't doesn't go like like uh, Pujols. You know what happened to him? Pujols Pujols turned 30. It was like kind of ball game. Danny Martinez has had a good start. Is Chant though probably? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Hey man, I'm I'm all for Trout winning another one. Um, you know. But I also like to see see uh, Trump going into the uh, playoffs. Yeah, Red Sox are, are really that. Eh, they could be one of the biggest surprises. Them and the Royals. I'm really surprised with the Royals too. I mean, and the Royals. I mean, Bobby Witt. I think is going to be a good player for the Royals. Man, you imagine when he. This is an autograph. I think right here. I'm pretty sure this is an autograph. Maybe, no, maybe not. No, it's not. Uh, eight, speaking of the Royals, it's the Lacey 54150, Kansas City, and Tommy T. I, I think the I love seeing these small market teams like Kansas City do good. I have no problem KC winning. So, Argraph is going to be the last one. Is that how you're going to play us? Oh, guys, look at that. It's gold. Oh, it's Minnesota. Oh, can we can we have a Sabato, please? It's gold. Oh, God, that would have been sick. Junior Severino, 22 out of 50. Go so, we, we hit orange in the first box, and now we hit gold for the Twins. Jeff M. Looking for the Sabato there, though. God, that would have been nice. It's too nice hit, though, bro. Uh, Mackenzie Gore, 168199 for the Padres. Billy B. Oh. Waters. Still not bad. Absolutely, right? 
What about Otani? You know, if if Otani can hit 25 to 30 homers, but he has to get, I'd say, 10 wins, I, I think he could win it. Problem is, I mean, he was always he was scr uh, scratched for his last um, his last start. I mean, he's got to win for the year, but he's got he's got to do more than just one win. If he gets ten wins, twenty five, thirty homers. I think he can win it. I uh, I was really hoping that was a um, Sabato for you, though, bro. Wow, it's so nice. So we start out with a hobby here with an orange and a gold shimmer, man. That is a way to start a case. Another awesome Martin, dude. That's like three of them now. Who is who is uh who's leading the American League Rookie of the Year? I have absolutely no idea. I have no idea. What, Mountcastle? I mean, I think he hit his third home run today, I think. Who else is competing for that over there? I just don't know. Did you really? You did about his cousin? Didn't end well, fortunately. <laughs> no way, dude. That's so weird. Such a small world, man. That's that's too bad that, that you aren't still with her, man. You can get all kinds of good stuff from him, then. <laughs> Pirates Pipeline. Oh, man. Small world. Let's go with Evan White. You know, Mitchell. I knew he was a paper here. Let's go with uh, Jordan Adams, 268-499 for those Angels. Sean R. <laughs> I feel right. <laughs> hey, man. You, you can always say that, though. You know? I dated Sabato's cousin. Another Carlson. There he is, man. Maybe maybe this guy comes up and wins rookie of the year, right? I I mean, Kriloff was doing pretty good too. I mean, power wise, I'm not sure what happened to him. He must have got injured. Again, I don't follow the American League very well. Aaron Judge? Ah, you know what? I think um isn't Stanton having a pretty good year? Oh, I, dude, I absolutely love Steph Curry, man. Oh, guys, dude, he's he's the best. He is so much fun to watch. He's one of my favorite players, without a doubt, man. Guy's awesome. I love Steph Curry, man. Maybe a dog starts to or matter go. Yeah, matter go. It's true. See, the problem with, problem with Marigold is he has no power. No power. Oh, man. Nice nice time for uh, Kalenic. Very nice. Cam. Oh, that's a good time. Singer, yeah. I, I don't know either, man. You know? I, I'm i just not... I, yeah, I'm not really familiar with the American League. I mean, it very well could be someone like Kalanick that comes up and just crushes it, you know? Because I, I, I don't think, like, Mountcastle isn't, like, like destroying the league. I mean, he's got a head start, obviously, to anyone that comes up now. But Kalanick can totally come up and crush. That's the problem. I mean, I, I love Madrigal, man. I, I do. But... He's gonna be no home runs for the guy. He he'll have to hit like you know 330 something like that. Have close you know 180 200 hits, and then he may win it. But he only have maybe like three home runs. The dude's just he got he has like no power. Oh Mercedes, good one, bro. Yeah yeah yeah, you're right, man. Good one. 
Choo choo choo. Yep, yep. That's it. That's the guy right now. Casey Mize. Oh, dude, I think I think who I picked for the American League this year was um, Andres Gimenez for the Indians. I, I don't think he's doing good, though. I think that's who my pick was. So way off on that one. Uh, let's see. Braves pipeline. Let's see, I saw that card. It's just a Shea Langoliers. Light, the White Sox season is it's going to be a, it's going to be tragic. You know, they, the injuries have, are just going to kill them, dude. There's no way they're going without without um, Eloy and Lou Bob. I don't see it happening. I think I think losing Eloy is was bigger than losing Lou Bob for him though. God, another Costa. It's two of them. Because I, I, I mean, I think a healthy Elo, although he's such a liability defensive, but uh, offensively, I mean, the guy's like guy's easy thirty hundred, easy mode for Eloy. I mean, Lou Bob, you just don't know. Not Eddie Diaz. I was going to see you. Okay. What what happened to Kriloff? He had those two games. I think it's an autograph here, right? Ooh, what is that? So, um, did Kruloff get injured? Because he had like he had like three homers in two games. Oh, it's not, but it's still a cool card. Tyler Freeman's gonna be one four three two nine nine Cleveland and Todd B. Yeah, nice card. I mean, Kruloff strikes out a lot, but I mean, he's young. <laughs> You're in pain. Yeah, I guess so. I I do not know what what Garcia's uh, stats are. I have not been following that guy at all, so I'm not really sure about him. Uh, Ours Arena. Yeah, that's a tough loss for the Cards for sure. Sure. But I mean, again, you could be like the Cubs man and just like you know. Luis Eloy and Torres. Although, I, I wasn't expecting longer up there. Eddie Yeen for the Nats. John T. John. Nice, John. First is Big Vogel. Yeah, you know what? I Yeah, I, I do think Arizona does qualify. Peterson, Bitsko, this guy here, Rodriguez. Jack Kelly. And J Dom, Kerstad, and Kevin Alcantara base paper. That's how we end box number three. Yeah, yeah, I think I was just, he was just like the, um, just a stud in the playoffs. He didn't really play. Yeah, he wasn't playing that that long in the regular season. Uh, Hayes. Yeah, he's my favorite. I can't believe this guy's still injured, man. What the heck, dude? Didn't, didn't seem that serious, man. Sanchez. So Blaze first. Put the Blaze first, man.
Ibo Wells. This is Sabato. Jose Garcia. There's my pick for the American League. I don't think he's doing too good, though. Yeah, there's two. He's pretty still young. Oh, nice Kirillov, man, for the Twins. Dang. 23 out of 250. Minnesota Jeff, man. Minnesota's had a good break. Emerson Hancock and Taylor Trammell. Let's go back out to Seattle and Cam. Kepler, Chris Morrell, Addison Reyes, See, it looks like the autograph seems to be in this first stack, at least for these four, four boxes. So we'll just move our way down. Give you guys something to look forward to there. Unless you throw a curveball. Uh-oh, what's up, LP? My friend broke his leg, so I wrote you or super on this cast. I was just <laughs> so injured. This leg has never been so humorous. <laughs> Such a dork, dude. <laughs> Dude got me a Bidja relic card from from what man? From Heritage? Mm. Tina first. Let's go Cronenworth, J Dom. Why is it J Dom not playing yet? He's got why is he in the minors through some? That was a good fling in there, guys. Flinging. Oh, Heritage, nice. And Bobichette and Randy Arjuna, rookie from. Wow, very nice, bro. Your comic shop again? I'm assuming it's your comic shop. Pipeline will be the uh, Mets. There's a Gomez again. Ton. Oh, Frank and Sons. Okay. Do you do you ever buy singles out there, or do you just pretty much buy wax and just uh? I mean, wax is fun for sure. Franco. Let's go, bro. Get your butt up. And text my, uh, my luck and bought a 2019 Tots Pack to try and get the Tatis Jr. rookie, but no. Singles and wax. Gotcha. Tatis would be a nice hit, bro. For sure. Uh, Chris Dad. Chris Dad again. You know what? Chris Bryant right now is having an MVP season, believe it or not. He's ha he he's balling right now, man. I mean, Cubs are definitely training him, but he's he's having an MVP season. Oh, nice. A Cronworth Blue Auto. Not bad, bro. Congrats. Congrats. Oh, I got some of these invoices real quick. Uh, we got here. This is Rays. What time is it? it, it yeah, let me send this. Give me one second, guys, to send these invoices. We're right back. I found a Tatis rookie in one of those Walgreens. No kidding. 
What is this? Wow, you thought... That's, that's what happened. 2017. It's, wait, no. Chris Bryant? Was it 2017? Was it? Alright, give me a second, guys. Let me send invoices for this tier one. I'll be right back. We got here purchase, purchase, purchase. Nick. We got here, Nick. Like that, is that it? Is anyone else paid or? What's this going on? Did I mess up? Uh, no, everyone else is paid. Dang, man. Ballers. You see what's going on? 2015. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was 17. Yeah, right. MVP, MVP of the year, the Cubs won. Right. Yeah, I didn't think it was 2017. Some cool cards from those as well. One paper was it? Rain Josh rookie card. Yeah, that's sick, dude. That's a nice. It. My only problem with, with like the Randy Johnson rookie cards is it's like twenty billion of them from each each one. So if you don't get like a PSA ten of those, it's not worth crap, man. It's like worth like like a dollar or something. If it's not great, like a ten. Good old good old tops and they crap. Is this autograph? No, oh, but it's cool as heck. Let's go. Um, Anthony Volpe for the Yankees, 47 on the 99 green. Sit, Todd. I, I, that guy's going to be a pretty good player, too. Clinic, Duran. Put me a Wander auto. Yeah, I'd love to. I love, I love Wander. I do have some money invested in that boy. Hoping the race calm up, man. Uh, Matter go Boz. All right, guys. Finish. That could be our autograph. We on that one. I, don't know, I just want to pull the last autograph yet. Unless this color, I can figure it out. No, that's not it. Josh Bell, Lacy. Royce, last two packs, guys. Go give you a recap. Give you a recap here. Sure, what we got here. Is this the autograph? The last one. Uh, I think this is the autograph. Was I wrong? No, nope, wasn't. I was totally right with the pack. All right, let's see what we got. Good luck, guys. Looks like we're gonna have ourselves a little sparkle one too. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's finish up here with Red Sox. It's going to be Brainer Banaki. And that's going to be 248, 299. Nice hit, Boston. And John T. We only got one base tonight, man. We come to Lagos. That's pretty cool. And we got some green here to finish off the break. We're going to go Ivan Johnson for the Reds, 86, 399. And Manuel, you finish it off. With the hits. Give you guys a recap here. Uh, let's see here. Basically, awesome Martins. I think we got we got the three base. Let me get any chrome, I don't think. Uh, what else? I think we got like a a blaze and a sabato. What's that number? Hmm? Oh, number? Yeah, I'll get that. Let me see here. All right, let's go over some of these. Tommy here, guys. We got Trammel, Clinic, Kerstad. 
This is numbered actually Hancock's 150, Patrick Bailey. We got the Ivan Johnson, Volps to 99, Krilloff to 250, Adams, Freddie Freeman, I want to say Freddie Tyler, Lacey is to 150, Mackenzie Gore is a buck 99, and Sabato is a 499. Let's go over the autographs. Which which card you which card you are you are uh, referring to? The centering. The autographs, man. We start out on fire, bro. Let's go with these autographs here. All right, we're gonna have uh, Eddie Yeen. We got the uh, Bringer Banaki to two ninety nine. You want the the Severino? Junior Severino is to fifty. And Nick Matana, this is 600 once again, bro. You contact me if you want insurance. 21 out of 25. It has to be on the top, top order. That's where I guess. Oh, the last hour got pretty pre centered. What was that? This guy right here? Yeah. Yep. Oh, looks pretty good. Looks pretty clean. Sure does. It's kind of all look pretty good. I mean, you know, without. Using your magnifying glass or your uh, your centering tool, they all look pretty decent. All right, guys. Oh, the red sauce on. Yep, guys, we're out. We got tier one in about twenty something minutes. We'll be back, uh, and we'll be again be back again tomorrow night to continue with this Bowman break.